Hola pessoal, soy el Pablo de Podcast Subtitulados y yo quería divulgarte contigo el método que me hizo fluido en inglés en tres meses. Solo haciendo lo que este chico habla en su curso, entonces si quieres ser un máster en inglés, compruebe el primer link de descripción. Do you have any regrets about being in the adult industry? Um, if you could go back, would, is there anything you would change? I don't think so. No. I think, you know, it's so weird because I remember when I first started, there was makeup artists who would say, why are you doing this? Why are you doing that? You should charge more money if you're doing that. Mm -hmm. And I, and it was, I guess like, here's the thing. I wasn't doing it for the money. Yeah. But I did enough research before getting into it that I knew, okay, I'm going to have, I'm going to make pretty good money compared to other people my age without a college education. Mm -hmm. Like I knew that going into it, mm -hmm. but it wasn't like everything was a bartering factor for me when yeah. I was doing scenes. And so it was like, I, again, going back to like goals, plans, ideas, why I came into the industry in the first place, it would all mean nothing if I started to say, well, I'm going to charge more for this. Or I'm going to charge more for that. Of course, eventually I did because then my worth grew and then right. I was able to, and that's right. a different story. But right. yeah, overall, I would say like in the industry, no. Yeah. Like, do I like the way certain things played out? No, mm -hmm. but I can't control that. You right. can't control everything. Right. Um, no. Yeah. Regrets in, in life. Yes. Right. yes. But like the regret of going into the industry, no, because it gave me so much that I would not have otherwise. Right.